As of season six on DMZ, the only way to cheese Pyro is at the U.S. Embassy. Uh, developers have fixed the other two locations. So I'm going to show you how to kill him solo without a key. If you're wanting to get that medic plate carrier barter unlocked or armor plates for cheaper. I usually come up to this top building here, uh, zip line all the way to the top, and then parachute over. There are ladders around the embassy that you can actually climb up and get to this particular section of the roof. Or you could drive a vehicle over and then mantle up onto the uh, ledge we're going to be landing on. I do think the pyro is one of the easiest bosses to kill. Any drops one of the better three-plate carriers for solo players. It allows you to heal much quicker. And with only three bandages, one watch, and one liquor, it's pretty easy to craft. So there you go. You see the pyro is inside. Just drop down to this front ledge here, and you'll be able to look inside of this window. And he should spawn inside. Um, now, it doesn't necessarily need to have the weapon case to spawn here, um, but you can see he's right there with a riot shield. Um, and you can shoot that gun. So you see the laser on the uh, shotgun, and then you just shoot that and you'll be damaging him. If he repositions, you can also shoot his foot, uh, but you'll want a munitions box because you'll go through quite a bit of ammunition. Uh, just shooting his hand takes quite a while to bring him down. Something else that could be helpful would be drill charges. I didn't bring any, but you can throw those through the wall. And then also, if you are having trouble finding him, uh, using an unsuppressed weapon can get his attention, uh, shooting some of the enemies around. Uh, I did have to run down to like the bottom floor and then uh, on one of the runs and then like shoot the door and then he kind of glitched through the door and then you could use the ladder on the south side of the building to climb up and get back on top and then shoot him through the window again. And after enough damage, you'll see the 500 experience points pop up and that means that the boss is now dead. You get credit for the kill even though you don't get to pick up his stuff. If you did have an embassy key, you could run in there and pick up the items he drops. Check out another video over here. If you shop at Amazon, I've got links down in the description to save you money. It'll also throw a couple of pennies at me. No cost to you. Any other questions or comments, put below. Thanks.